it's going to be a remake video of my Pika light, no right turn traffic lights that I got off eBay, off an eBay seller. Now, what's really cool about this this light is it's preheat. I don't know if this is a retrofit, but as you can see, it's got a G8 pre 16 watt 2D bend light bulb in it. And this cover is removable, you just undo these four little latches here, and you can change the bulb. So, as you can see, this has been converted to 240 volts. Also, it's got a very thick wire. That wire is very thick. It's like an industrial style wire. And here's where I have this is where I have it plugged in. I have it plugged in behind here next to my my home, my computer. So it uses it uses a non a plastic plug as you can see. So I'll show you. The paint to remove that so of this extension needs. Plug. I just need to pick my speakers back up in a second, but here's a plug that still wide up to it. The plug is a Knightsbridge plastic plug. So I'll plug it back into this extension lead now in a second. Also look how thick the wire is, it's about the same. It's a very good quality wire this, very high quality wire. When I first got it I thought it, it was going to be LED or halogen or something like that. But it turns out it was actually, it was actually pre fluorescent, which I think is pretty cool. You can see the wiring down there, as you can see. Yep. This is a self ballasted lamp, I do believe. Yes, I do. I do know the full fact. This is preheat. There's the bulb bit that's in there. It's one of those two D bent light bulbs, like I said. So it's the front of it. Very cool this trap that is, it's very cool. The side, it's quite, it's quite heavy as well. It's, I, I highly, I, I think this thing's made out of polycarbonate. Here's the back. I would have preferred to get a Siemens Helios, but I like, I do like Peak as well. There's Peak's logo. I believe this is Peak's older logo because Usually it says peak traffic, this one just says peak. As you can see, it's certificate established. That's where they filed off the plastic in the mould. That's where the wire's attached. So yes, it's a very big traffic light. This thing is made for transport for London, as you can see. A little label there, focus iPhone. I'm using my iPhone because it's got better video quality than my iPad. Focus. And you can see this is for transport for London. So this traffic light was originally on a street in London before they were replaced with LEDs. As you can see, the top screws have been rusted from rain because this is a real traffic light. It has been used in the road at some point. Here's the button. This is the top, and here's the button. The bottom looks exactly the same as the top. Take a bit of the water in. Yeah, I'll probably get something to put over. This like some like a like a rubber like something to keep you know liquids out. 
Anyway, this is a really cool traffic light, and now we're going to turn it on. Watch this, it's preheat. Watch this. See? Isn't that cool? The start is in the, in the bulb. But as you can see, this is a very cool. It didn't give off too much light. It's nice. It's a nice mood light. But when it's night time, it, it is actually a very good new light, mood light. The bulb does not flicker on camera. That's just... That's just the camera making it flicker. It's a bit of dust on this, actually. But yeah, as you can see, it gives off a really nice effect. Yeah, it makes a really nice mood light. We'll start it off a few more times. It, it doesn't always flicker. So, although it is preheat. See, sometimes it doesn't flicker at all. See? Sometimes, sometimes it doesn't flicker, but it, it is preheat. And you're wondering where I got this this traffic light from? I got it from eBay. They also had, I believe it was a turn a turn right symbol. I got the no right turn instead. Because I ordered the no right turn. It's not as big as a f what it would be. It's fairly big, but it's not too big. If you know what I mean. So yeah, as you can see, it's still got a bit of road dust in it because when I bought it, it was covered in road dust. The seller, the seller didn't clean it very well, so his fingers need to clean at some point. But yeah, that's, that's my Pika light. traffic lights that I got maybe at some point I'll get a, f a full traffic light and put it on top of this but, but you never know I'm so happy to have my peaker light traffic light in, nonetheless so what do you guys think of my peaker light traffic light that I got it about sometime last year. Ne it was near the end of 2019 when I bought this, by the way. Let me know what you think of my Pika Light Travel Light in the comment section below. Tell me what you guys think. Anyway, for now, guys, I'm going to be signing out. So thanks for watching and bye for now.